If you know of weather lore, you may have heard of a temperature inversion. This is like out west in uh, California. And if it's a polluted day with cool, moist air below the warmer, dry air on top, and that warmer, dry air seals away the cool, uh, polluted air and moist air from the ocean from going up over the mountain and uh, relieving the pollution. So I think we could take uh, large inflatable conduits. I'd once thought of uh, piping, uh, you know, heat from Florida up to the East Coast, and that way in large conduits. The problem is that the pressure would be, you have to be large to pump it for hundreds of thousands of miles, and that would make it so that you would get that much air, and it would be large, you have to build over a lot of property, and, uh, you know, stuff like that. It's going to have air leaks, it's going to have small air leaks, it's going to multiply, it needs a lot of pressure to move it against the gradient of uh, the north and south uh, temperature gradient. But for Los Angeles, you have the cool air and you pump it, it would take a lot smaller pipes for this for a city, and you would have the inflatable conduits that go up the side of the mountain, they'll, they'll have towers at the top of the mountain, and this would just simply blow that polluted air way up high where it blows away. It goes away much faster from uh, and saving all those people from that discomfort. And uh, the idea of uh, you know using those um, those conduits, I think, might be a place for like desert cities with uh, with uh, airships that would have not solar collectors on top. They have those, and. Uh, I think they're collecting uh, a lot of heat up there, and uh, they could use uh, pipes from the desert area to pipe the heat up, the air, hot air upward. Use it to melt those ice crystals. There's like 10 feet of water above us up there in the, um, you know, the air. There's like 1,000 pounds of, 10,000 pounds of pressure on our, on our um, head because of the water pressure. So we pump the hot air upward, and it melts those cr ice crystals and cools the air, pump more cool air down, and also the water to the reservoir, you got a source of uh, water and you've got a source of, um, you know, uh, cool air. And you've also piped even the hot air away from the town. And uh, I think we'd have larger conduits, medium-sized conduits that go from the central pipe downward to where they want to pipe it to. And uh, we also call this for the wave, we call this uh, wave in the arena.